my double chins. I'm sorry. I just about, I'm sorry that I look like this, but it is currently 6.40 a.m. in the morning, and I have already drove to Bournemouth. Um, so, this is... I have some exciting news. Um, well, this will be released once the show is out, so you would have watched me on SAS Who Dead Wins by this point. Who knows what would have happened. But basically, I'm three weeks out and I have a lot of work to do. Some areas more than other. So my swimming's pretty awful. Like, I mean, like, my swimming is zero existent so i'm currently at Bournemouth beach park hopefully not gonna get a ticket because i'm parked on a double yellow line but it's so early surely the ticket man ain't gonna come at this time um and i'm gonna go and have a swimming lesson in the sea but yes yeah, so i'm gonna try to bring you along for the next three weeks and you guys can watch me die. And I really need a poo, by the way. And how am I meant to poo? I also bought some, like, this wetsuit yesterday. Uh, in the kids section. Because... Basically, the adult ones were, like, 80 quid. But the kids ones are only 20 quid. So... I got a kids one. And it fits okay, actually. I was a bit worried about the thighs. But yeah. Enjoy. I finished my swimming lesson. <laughs> it was... It was... I haven't been in the English sea since I was, like, seven. Is that a good test? That's like K-Boss. Yeah, what it are you doing? I'm not sure it's going to be... What are you doing? I'm just telling them about my swimming lesson. Oh, is this any of your vlog? No, this is a SAS. SAS vlog. Yeah. Yo, you're going to be vlogging it. That's sick. Can I, can I be in? Yeah, um, so. I went okay. I'll insert some clips. Um, so, this is the first time I've ever done front crawl. Um, and it was quite hard, but. My swimming coach was really good and helped me relax my breathing. And now we're just doing some jujits. And it was so funny. I was literally like in the South Pole in Bournemouth and I was like naked in my car trying to get changed. <laughs> no way. Why? Because how you else? You just was... asked to come back to mine or something and change in the lounge. Yeah, but how <laughs> would I, how would I have got, how <laughs> would I, but I had to get in my car. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, so you're like in the back seat, so okay. you got tinted windows. Yeah, the I back. So I had to like, <laughs> and I was thinking this person's just gonna walk out of the house and see me like, because <laughs> I didn't want to drive to the gym. No, and... Look through the window, like, what? and it's fine when you're in the water, but actually when you get out, it's cold. Do you know what you're gonna be doing here on SS? Like, what sort of stuff they're gonna throw at you? What is it? Is it elimination? So who can survive till the end? Yeah. No way. So there's a winner? Yeah. And the winner gets 10 grand? No. <laughs> What's the prize? You just win. You just win? Yeah. What do you get when you win a jiu-jitsu competition? Fuck all! <laughs> Basically like that. You get a pin. You just get a... You just, so you actually don't you win nothing, though. How many girls are there? I don't know. I literally don't know anyone. You just go so there. you probably got in out of, like, what? How many entries? There's so many entries. Okay. So we're going to train some choo choo. So we've done some drilling. We need to do some yoga. And then we're going to go at lunchtime to the gym. And then we're going to go back to Jiu Jitsu tonight, aren't we? Full day, full day of training. Full day of training. And then Harry can take an easy day tomorrow. Easy day tomorrow? Yeah. Yeah. Full day. Oh, hello. By the way, I was like, I have no idea how these vlogs are going to work out because you know, I'm a ship vlogger and I just do random basic video clips of me when I think of something to do. Um, but I have. So, 
Oh, hello. Hello, Stagy. Hello, boy. Oh, I'm doing that annoying dog voice. So, today I got my boots. Do they look uncomfortable? Oh, do they look okay? So, I used to try and get my feet used to wearing, like, running in these these boots but funny story two nights ago at training my um my toenail fell off so putting my foot in this right now not good so they're just gonna have to wait for like two days um while my toenail slowly recovers um, but basically, also, um, I have a competition this weekend. And the old grappling. <sighs> it's basically a females only submission only event for Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. And. Yeah, my body's just kind of fucked. My knees are fucked. My hands are fucked. And now I have no toe now on my toe. So I'm just a bit of a mess. Oh, yeah. It's not good. But she had some really good sleep last night. So today I need to get back on it. I'm not going to do any more strength until after I fought. And then, yeah, that's it really. Well, see you soon when I'm running in my boots. So, today's the first day I've run in my boots. I feel very heavy. I'm in my sauna suit and my layers. And I just feel some cows on my way. The boots, I'm not gonna lie, are quite heavy. Like, obviously, this is gonna take a couple of weeks to get used to, but they are like when you're running, your legs get tired with these heavy boots on, and the, the sole on a suit is definitely not helping. But I don't know where. I'm going to be getting the scent, so I have to be ready for extreme heat. That's why I've got my sauna suit on to try and make my body hotter. And I obviously need to get these boots wet in and get used to running in them. Because obviously I'm used to running in trainers. Um, so yeah. I've still got like a kilometre and a half to go. I'm just trying to walk at a good pace. This is hard, up the hills is, is hard. So I'm gonna keep going. Push me up. Alloy. It is still Thursday and I just finished my swimming lesson at Padley Swimming Pool. So I started like a group one here and it's like every Thursday for like half an hour and like one of the girls stays after to like help me in the <laughs> deep end which is really lovely she obviously doesn't have to um but yeah it was good we did some front call today but now i need to get home and get in the bath and then go to bed because it's been a long day of training morning everyone it's wednesday the 24th of august i didn't vlog yesterday which was a tuesday that's because i was just at work and um i just went to jujitsu which i can insert some videos and pictures of but there's basic this ain't really what this vlog is about this vlog is about me running and 
swimming and doing things that I don't normally do to get ready for SAS. Um, this morning I'm going to go on a run with my brother and I'm just trying to put clothes on that will like be similar. So I'm going to wear some tuxedo bombs and like a top and a rucksack and my boots and stuff but I will um what is that I will video when I'm ready I'm out <laughs> haven't done my hair because I don't care but I'm looking a bit more alive I'm just going to meet my brother so I'm wearing the weighted vest and my big rucksack because um he's probably gonna wear the weighted vest and i'm gonna wear the rucksack because i need to get used to wearing the rucksack now because it's slightly different to wearing the weighted vest even though they both are very heavy um i'm just walking to meet him because it's quite hard to run in both and i've got my boots on I got my wrestling scramble bottoms and my scramble top and just going to walk to meet him. We don't live too far apart, so it's fine. That's wish me luck. Fucking dying. Very that was really hard. I went with my That was really hard. We did 5k in just under 30 minutes. Grant had the vest on, I had the bag on and my boots and I could feel my feet ripping in that last 1k but it's done now I need to have a shower and start working we're gonna go swimming tonight because today I do do jujitsu sorry let's peace morning guys it is um, Thursday the 25th, I think. And my neck is ruined from running with this backpack. Let me, let me try and show you. I don't know if you can see that side. And then this side's really bad because I have a hanging mole. So I need to... I don't know if you can really see that. But... I have like a hangy mole on that side and it's like scabbed up. So I actually really need to be quite careful. So I might have to run without the backpack for a couple of days. I just put loads of cream on it so it's extremely sore. Sorry, I just brushed my teeth and I realised I'm like dribbling. Um, I just wake up and today, yesterday I like ran and then did back and biceps. And then try to have an early night, but I'm really struggling with that lately. So it's me after my run. The boots are very muddy. That was a hard one. I need to try and get my boots off now. Because it's gross. <sighs> to be honest, it's quite like windy today, so it was like quite fresh air, but still really hard in those boots there's a part of the run that basically I can't breathe um, there's a part of the run that goes quite uphill but it's like off road so it's very bumpy which means afterwards it takes me quite a long time to like catch my breath um, I have a sandy um, so I have to really oh, sorry. but after that bit I have to really try and focus on just like breathing because 
my, my breathing's just not okay at that point. Put my boots outside. I need to quickly jump in the shower and then back to work. And then today I think I'm gonna go to the gym and do legs because I have a hello. That's disgusting, I'm sorry. Yeah, so I'm gonna do legs because I basically did like all day jujitsu. Monday, Tuesday, yesterday I did back and biceps and my run. Today I'm gonna do my run that I just done, um, legs, and then I'm gonna do swimming tonight, and then tomorrow I have a swimming lesson in the morning. I'm gonna do some jujitsu, and then I've got to teach my women's jujitsu class, and then basically I think Saturday I have a swimming lesson in the sea. Um, a swimming lesson in the sea and then I have That's gross. and then I have a a big uh, jiu-jitsu open mat and then I've got and then Sunday we're gonna do some like more SAS stuff so like more like running and do some weights go for like a long walk and stuff like that in my boots okay i'm gonna jump in the shower and then i'll meet you at the gym i'm sorry but this camera is not doing hard for me this is literally like a growing ball on my foot and it is passing. it's very so all right sunny oh look at that focus hello <laughs> i just finished legs at the gym I get a bit camera shy, I'm not going to lie, especially at this time. So it's like five o'clock, so it's really busy. So I'm not going to lie, do you get a bit camera shy? It's too busy in there. Um, I'm sure I'll get better. Um, yeah, it was a good leg session. Um, I managed to get on everything I wanted. Because sometimes I just work out at my home gym, you know. Because... You can't, you can never normally get a rack or anything like that. And it's just annoying. But, yeah. I need to really grab some, like, bits from the shop. So I think I'm going to have to go Tesco's way a bit. But I actually need to do, like, a full-on food shop. But I can't, I can't be asked. I can't be asked. Hello. A bit of a random one. I'm just going to have to chip in here because... I've got too much bloody footage, I can't put it all in one video. Um, it's actually October 30th, from where I'm coming from you now, so the whole course has all been said and done. It's so funny watching this back, because like I just had no idea what I was getting myself into. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to leave this one here, I hope you enjoyed, and I'm going um, to have to do a part two, because there's too much going on. So I hope you enjoyed that.